one guy's trash can be another guy's treasure. And so closing the loop and working with other industries that you never thought of working with before has been extremely valuable. The partnership between Ford Motor Company and Heinz is all about improving our environmental impact and making the world a better place by using each other's discard materials. One night we were at dinner with Heinz and they were complaining about the billions of pounds of tomatoes that they squeeze, all these excess stems, the seeds and the peels, there is no use for. And so he was complaining and I said, why don't you just ship some to me? Which was a joke initially, but we suddenly realized that in fact, it could be used as a reinforcing fiber for plastics. And that's where it all started. We take the waste material from Heinz and we're able to put it into plastic materials and then test them toward getting them on Ford vehicles. What we do is receive the tomato fibers. We grind them down, mix them with plastic through a process called extrusion. We injection mold them into bars and into parts, and then we evaluate those materials. People do think you're crazy. Um, and initially I thought that it was so challenging we'd never get it done, but there are so many applications on a typical vehicle, about 300 pounds of plastic on a typical car, all kinds of resin, all kinds of reinforcements, and our job is to figure out exactly where the Heinz material fits. We'll find the right place and put it there. There's no reason these materials can't be used in office furniture, in child um, seats, many household items, and so I feel like our impact can be so much broader. When people find out we're working on the materials, they tend to call and see if it fits into their industry as well. You know, the, one of the exciting things that we have learned through the partnership with Heinz is that it's another demonstration of how many waste products we have in the world and how one person's garbage can become a very useful, durable product in another industry. And I think we should partner like this more and more. I think when you make an impact like this and it has the potential to be put out into the world, um, it's really gratifying and I hope more people want to get on board and, and develop green materials.